The second control of the asset management clause is called, ownership of assets. This control states that every asset that has been entered to the inventory, must have an owner that is responsible for it during its life cycle. The control says that an asset owner is an individual who has been given the management's approval to utilize that asset, and be responsible for its security. An asset owner should ensure the access to the asset he is responsible for, is controlled and as per the business requirements and policies. Delegation of access to the asset does not change the accountability of the owner. Although an employee can be identified as an asset owner, he still does not hold property rights to the asset, for example, he is not allowed to sell the asset, or use it for an unintended purpose. The inventory records should show who the asset owners are, and during which periods of time. This helps in easier traceability, or for example in an investigation if it was needed.